sisi kama shirika la Action Aid tumefanya na hii jamii wa Kamuthe na tumefanya na wao kazi nyingi e, tulijaribu kufanya tume, tumefanya kazi ya kuinua maisha ya wasichana na pia kuinua maisha ya wamama tulijaribu kuanzisha wao uh, economical empowerment kujendesha kwa, kwa, kwa hali ya kimapato mapato. na pia tumesaidia wasichana kuwapatia eh, eh, sanitary pads na pia kuwapatia chakula wakati wana eh, wako kwa shule pia tumewajengea uh, mahala pa kulala haswa wakati wa wako wa shule sababu tuliona ya kwamba wasichana hawapewi eh, hawana hawa, hawa na mahali pa kulala sisi kama shirika tutaendeleza hiyo kazi na tutaendeleza kuinua maisha ya wasichana na wamama. Asante. E, kwanza tuko na utamaduni mbaya katika e, jamii yetu ya Kisomali kwa sababu wasichana wanaolewa wakiwa na miaka ya chini sana. Hiyo itawafanya wasiweze kusoma. E, pia wengine wanaweza anza kusoma lakini wa, wa, waachilie katikati kwa sababu ya ukosefu wa karo. Kwa sababu kuna ufakara mingi katika jamii hii yetu na tuna tunahimiza ama kuomba serikali kuu iweze kutupatia e, usaidizi kwa wasichana ili waweze kumaliza shule kwa sababu wengi wanaacha shule katikati kwa sababu ya kukosa karo pia waendelee kufadhili hii mpango ya sanitary pads ili wasichana ambao hawawezi kununua e, vifaa hivyo waweze kupata changa moto kuu ambao wasichana wanakosa kwenda shule ni haswa ni dhulma ya ukeketaji kwa hivyo kama department tuko na afisa ambao wako on ground na wanaweza kuchunguza maneno kama haya ili wasichana wapewe nafasi sawa na wavulana ili waendelee kusoma pia tuko na mpango ya sanitary pads kwa wasichana wasichana wengi wanakaa nyumbani kwa sababu ya kukosa uh, hizo vifaa kwa hivyo serikali yetu imejikakamua kuona kwamba vifaa hivi vimeweza kupelekwa shuleni for today the theme is girl force unscripted unstoppable we have noticed that the girls have some falls and they are moving on but we realize this is not written down it is unscripted and therefore for today we want to tell the whole world all the kenyans and the world that we need to record what the girls have achieved this far it may be little but we need to record what they have achieved the girls themselves have spoken the girls in this place in Fafi as i said earlier on have spoken and said so far they have managed a few of them have managed to go to school a few of them have been rescued from early marriages a few of them have faced the knife in matters fgm but they are crying to the world that all this negative attitude has to stop and what we are getting from the girls is that they know their rights in this country in Kenya in our const constitution the constitution of Kenya 2010 to be precise article 53 gives us the rights of the child and one of those rights is education the girls and the boys must get basic education and this should be in the best interest of the child the girls in Kamude have spoken. We, we also want to call upon the boys, the fathers, the mothers, to be in a position to support the girls. I am very impressed as an individual that the girls in Kamude know all those women who they say are girls like themselves, who are in governance and leadership in government. So the girls in Kamude are gearing to go and we should not stop them. Instead, we should record what they have so far achieved and then give them the way to go ahead and achieve even more. I am actually very much impressed and I want to call upon our own county commissioner, Mr. Meru, who we met this morning and he promised to be very supportive. I want to call upon our governor, Ali Korane. His Excellency is very supportive of the girls and I want to call upon all the MCs, MCS in this area. And I want in particular also to recognize in our county government those people who have been fighting for the girls, even at the local area. Please go ahead. For the fathers, let us support our daughters. Thank you.
Asante sana.